Okay, so the very first section it says simplify each expression. Okay, now um, the only problem is on this quiz, I see students have a tendency to try to force something. So is there anywhere that has an equals in here? No. Okay, so if it doesn't have an equals, that means you shouldn't have like an equals for an answer. Okay, there wasn't an equals, so don't just put one in there because students do it all the time. Okay, this says simplify each expression. So if um, and remember, you can use these. So this is AKA combine like terms. That's what it means. Okay, so if you don't know what that means, the fancy simplify each expression, it means combine like terms. It does not mean solve. Okay, it means combine like terms. So 10 minus 10n minus 4. What can we combine up here? The 10 and the 4. So 10 minus 4 is what? 6. And then I haven't used this minus 10n. This is your answer. Okay, that's what it should look like. Okay, do you want me to do 3 or 4? Okay, three, same thing. Um, what can we combine? The four, and the, ten. the four and the ten. We can put them together. They both have ends. Okay, so a ten and a four gives me what? Fourteen. Fourteen n. And what do I have left that I haven't used? The one. Plus one. And it's a plus one because remember, there's that magic plus one outside. What's up? Is it okay if I put one plus thirteen? Yes. Okay, so this is your answer. You want me to do five or six? Five. Okay, what do we do with parentheses? Yeah, we gotta distribute. Okay, so we're gonna say boom, boom. So you got negative three times negative four, 12 R, and negative three times a positive two, negative six. seven. So what number is in front of that N? There's a one right here. Okay. So put that little ghost one. It will help you out. Um, okay. So we got to distribute seven times negative one, negative seven, seven times negative one, negative seven N. Okay. Nine or 10. 10, we got to distribute 7 or 2 times 7V, 14V, 2 times negative 1, negative 2. Okay, by now you guys all should be pretty decent at this, right? Okay, this is why I do multi step. So this seems like forever ago we even did this, right? It's like, why is she even put this on quiz? Okay, you did do it, it was in chapter 2, we just separated the baby chunks, okay? So, I expect most of you guys to do really well on this quiz. Um, 11 or 12? 12, we're gonna distribute eight times, or negative eight times four. Negative 32R, negative eight times negative three. Positive 24. You want 13 or 14? Huh? Okay, what do we distribute on 14? The negative seven, so this part. Okay, this one you can go ahead and drop down. Okay, so we can go ahead and distribute negative seven times N negative 7n, negative 7 times a positive 6, 
Negative 42. Are we finished? No. Why not? Huh? There is three terms. Okay, and if you forgot what we're doing, right? Has there so like I want you to look at this because some of you guys you need to know how to not cheat but help yourself out. Okay, when you looked at and you started the paper, right? And this darker black is the subtitle, that's the directions. Has there been any other direction since then? No. So we're still on simplify each expression. That means combine like terms. Is every single thing combined in here that can be? No. So we're not done yet, okay? Um, because that, that's a trick to know when to stop and when to not stop, okay? If I said simply distribute, you would stop here. I said simplify each expression. That's not in simplest form, okay? So um, we can combine what? The 7 and the 42. So what is a plus 7 minus 42? Huh? Negative 35. Somebody agree? Yes. Minus 7 in. Okay, so now we're finished. What, 15 or 16? 16? Okay, what do we distribute? The negative two. The negative two. So this is what we're gonna distribute. Okay, do not combine these first. So go ahead and drop the one down. Negative two times four. Negative eight. And negative two times a positive five. Huh? Negative 10. Are we finished? No. What can we combine? The one and the ten to give me what? Negative nine minus eight n. Okay, 17 or 18? 17. 17. 17. Okay, so 17 says solve each equation. That means we're solving. Okay, um, now I wish that I had like um, a. So on Friday, Friday we had um, our steps, right? So our steps said distribute, then combine like terms, then add or subtract the kids, and then divide. Okay, but on all of these, some of them you're not even going to have a kid, or you're not going to have something where you can add or subtract or divide. So you're going to really need to be able to put your steps together and realize what to do first. Okay, so 17. What is the first thing that we can do? You could distribute. What's a minus minus? It's a positive. So we can convert this one to a plus. So I got x plus 5 equals negative 5. Huh? Okay, what's our next step going to be? We're trying to get x equals something, so x by itself. Subtract 5 from both sides. So I got x equals negative 10. Can we do 19 or 20? 19. 19. So what does this say right now? What's n over 3 mean? n divided by 3 equals 16. So how do I get n by itself? Multiply by 3. Multiply by 3. So you're going to do the opposite, okay? So you're going to say times 3. If we do it to one side, we got to do it to the other. So these 3's cancel, and I got n equals, what is 16 times 3? 
Gracie, put it up. Okay, you want me to do 21 or 22? 22. 22. What's going to be our first step? Combine like terms. Combine like terms. Okay, um, so what can we combine? The 1 and 2 to give me 3 plus 8m equals 3. 22. Okay, what's going to be our next step? Subtract three. Subtract three. A M equals what? One. Not one. Zero. Zero. Come on, Okay, what's your last step? Always. Divide. M equals. Hmm? Zero. Okay, 23 or 24? 24. 24. Okay, what's our first step? Distribute. Okay, and what are we distributing? The negative seven. The negative seven. Okay, so we're distributing this. So we're going to go ahead and drop this negative 6 down. And we're distributing this. So negative 7 times 8. Negative 56 R. Negative 56 R. Negative 7 times negative 5. Uh, yeah. Positive 35. Positive 35 equals 309. What's our second step? Hmm? Combine like terms. So what can we combine? 6 the 6 and the 35 to give me what? 41. Mm. Huh? 29. 29. Minus 56R equals 309. What's our next step? Huh? Subtract 29. Subtract 29 from both sides? Okay, so I got minus 56R equals, what's 309 minus 29? 230? Huh? 280? Somebody agree? Yeah. What's our last step? Divide by R equals... Is it five? Negative five? I hope so. I don't know what it is. Okay.